Welcome back. This morning on Fox 5, we are talking about healthy eating, even in our busy lives. Yeah, that's right, Annie. This morning uh, is this morning's Healthy in a Hurry segment. It's all about simple, nutritious meals that can be made in a hurry and on a budget. Joining us now is dietitian Charlotte Martin. Hello. I had a donut this morning. How bad am I starting <laughs> oh, off? Oh, don't want to talk Charlotte that. <laughs> Moderation is key, right? Yeah. yeah. So every once in a while, it's okay. Every once in a while, it's okay. But how many of us have been so busy that we either mm -hmm. forget to eat or we go home and we start binge eating? You know, we just overdoing it. Or we it skip it all together, yeah, right? Exactly. As a dietitian, I hear that all the time. Now, when it comes to eating healthy, meal prepping or meal planning is one of the best ways you can really set yourself up for success. But it's a little easier said than done. So I'll show you some of my favorites. Okay. So we'll start with breakfast. Um, so, you know, for those of us who'd rather drink our breakfast instead of eat our breakfast, mm -hmm. um, you know, a smooth, great start. Yeah. But that can even take a little time in the morning, Certainly measuring does, things yeah. out. So you can make it in bulk and then freeze it in an ice cube tray and then just grab and go. And you can actually just let it melt right in your cup. Oh, and okay. I love to start with a protein powder as our base, like our Metafast powders that are high in protein yet low in calories so I can add a lot of mix-ins like fruit mm. and oats without it being too high in calories. Now clear the air. So freezing this doesn't take mm. away any of the benefits from it your doesn't. veggies or fruits. It doesn't at all. Okay. Yeah. And some just, people do think that, you know. You know and, and you know, buying frozen vegetables or frozen fruits from the grocery store is a great idea too. Okay. And it, it holds longer. It kind of makes it easier. Yeah. So now for lunch. Your muffin pan is such a great tool for portion control. So it makes these portion controlled portable single serve meals. It's not just for cupcakes and muffins. I actually made these little low carb shepherd's pies here. So really easy and after you make them and let them cool down, you can freeze them and then just grab and go during the week oh, and just perfect. reheat it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. And it almost looks like a little cupcake so maybe you feel the mind a little. It does, <laughs> right, right. So you think you're eating that cupcake but you're not. <laughs> and what is this here? Is this so nuts? this is one of my new favorites for a snack. This is actually chia pudding. So it's kind of the same concept as overnight oats. Those chias are mm -hmm. soaking up liquid from Greek yogurt and almond milk. And I've portioned it out into little mini mason jars. You know, as a Metafast dietitian, I'm always preaching portion control, portion control, mm -hmm. you know, for that healthy weight management. So I've just portioned it out here. You can make a bulk amount on Sunday and then just portion it out into the little mini mason jars and grab and go during the week. And I recently discovered chia seeds, but they mm -hmm. are so packed with so many good things. Yes. And they Fiber. don't taste like anything. It kind of looks a little yep. funny. They look like little tapioca balls. Yes. And they, they kind of taste evolve. like it. Yeah. yeah. But it doesn't really taste like it. Like it's more of a consistency right. texture thing that yeah. bothers people, I think. So, so if I'm someone at work who like gets that 2 o'clock feeling yeah. in their stomach for hunger, will this, this fill me up? This is actually perfect. I'm glad you asked that because those chia seeds are packed fiber, yeah, as you mentioned, you and they absorb liquid, so it really does help fill you up. And oh, this okay. is pretty low calorie. Oh, chia seeds and water will keep yeah. you through the day. Um, and All real right. quickly, the final two. For dinner, so this is, my, I just recently discovered this. This is foil packet freezer meals. So this okay. is uh, raw chicken, some peppers, onions, and you just put it on a piece of foil. Annie, you can go ahead and drizzle this okay. on there. What is this? So this is just a chipotle sauce, really oh, easy to make. You, you can just pour it right on there. Mm -hmm. And then all you do is you just fold up these ends here. So we'll fold it up like this. Just make sure the um, chicken is covered so you can pull it. Like here, like inward, like this way, and then just roll oh. these up here, like that. Yeah, we kind of got it, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, you can see the ones I've made al already right there. Oh, like and that, then, okay. Yeah, and then you can just stack them in the freezer, and then you just take huh. one when you get home from work and throw it in the oven. That's super smart. Yeah. And while you're while that's baking in the oven, you can either warm up some whole wheat tortillas, or my favorite thing to do, serve it on cauliflower rice. So. I actually just rice a whole head or two of cauliflower on Sunday, oh, okay. put it in a freezer safe bag and just store it in the freezer. And you're good for the week. Oh yeah, gosh. and then I just grab a little measuring cup, put it in a bowl and I just microwave it. I love this idea. That is so smart. Yeah. Okay, Charlotte, thank you so much as always. Great ideas. Mike's going to try all of them and then report back to us. <laughs> yeah. No more donuts. No, no more donuts. <laughs> all right, time now is uh, not sure. 728. There you go. You're watching Fox by News at 7. We'll be right